Welcome back guys, my name is Kirby. I'm sorry I haven't uploaded in a while, but uh, yeah, you know, stuff's happening in life and such, so yeah, that's why I might not be able to upload as much as I would want to. So as you saw in the titles, we're making Big Man I Don't Love You today. This routine is very nice, I love it so much, and uh, I think Big Man does a very, very good job with this routine. So if you haven't already, check out the Big Man I Don't Love You, his routine. I have a link to that video down in the description, it's his wild card and it's very good very worth watching. You should really consider watching that. Let's start with the sounds you will need in order to make this pattern and the first sound is the siren. As you notice I'm not making it as high as usually. You're gonna keep your siren a bit lower. So to get the siren uh, I couldn't do it very good at all like just a few weeks ago so I think you can get the siren if you practice or not. So the first thing you have to think about when you make the siren is the sound you make. Like kind of simulate that sound. You don't have to go very high. It feels like I block it with my nose uh, But the sound is not actually coming from the nose. It's coming from my mouth So after you got that sound you gotta put your teeth on the bottom lip And now a tip that I got from a Swedish beatbox community friend uh birdie he's called i can link his uh, like wildcard and youtube channel down in the description so you can check him out he gave me a very valuable tip that if you place your tongue like this like widen it out and like try to block the uh, sound so you press your tongue in and then you kind of uh, tilt it up don't touch the roof of your mouth but uh, tilt it up at least mm, mm, mm. And you're gonna feel that the sound is uh, kind of easier to get if you do that. Try to widen it so you feel your tongue on your sides here. And you block out the sound that way, creating more vibration. Also one last tip on the siren I can give you is try to be very tense here in your mouth. Like very tense lips and tense everything right here. Apply a lot of pressure and I think you will get it. If you have lips like me, try to bend up your upper lip like this. Not. It doesn't sound as good. You will need the throat bass. The bow, 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 bow. And you will be able to make bing, bing, and voah, and stuff like that and talking in your throat bass. Wah, 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 hello, hello, hello. I have a tutorial for the throat bass, check that out down in the description. So when I type a big letter Y, I mean like a uh, throat bass siren. <coughs> it's both siren and throat bass at the same time. And that throat bass comes like, it feels like it's very far out in your mouth. <coughs> you will need a <coughs> It's like saying <coughs> rolling your R's and then saying it into your cheek cheek <laughs> this means breathing in <laughs> you will need the peh now <laughs> you will need the bmds now <laughs> and also bmg combined with a throat bass <laughs> you will need the inward bass <laughs> I have a tutorial explaining the inward throat bass a bit you will need the inward click rock <laughs> You will need the reverse lip roll. It's like making a big hole with your lip roll. And then you close it up. See tutorials down in the description. Also practice making this with the reverse lip roll. Very fast. Two reverse lip roll, a hi-hat and then two reverse lip rolls. You'll need the lip synth. That's just a small detail, it's not very important. You can say ooh instead. Try to practice this pattern. That is last A. It's very much falsetto voice. 
And one last thing, you don't necessarily have to learn this, but yeah, that's the last thing he does. So it's the it's like a throat bass and uh, a laser in the end, and it's the it's like saying and then dragging your uh, bottom lip over your bottom teeth. Now, when we went through the sounds, let's go through the patterns that you will need. The first pattern you will need is the. This is actually the thing uh, Begman starts with in his routine. It's pretty straightforward. It's making a siren and then a throat bass siren. It's making like every other. And then three regular. So yeah, that's not too difficult. You should practice that a bit. Uh, then you should practice this basic pattern. It's you can also do it like you can choose yourself, but Big Man makes all alternating and you don't have to think about that too much. I think uh, if you want to, you can stick with one or the other. You don't have to do both. And you should also practice. You can also practice. It's combining a B and G snare and a siren there in the middle. Also, you should try to practice this pattern. So you hum. You sum that melody while you do this. This is basically a BMG snare and a throat bass. And then you hum with a. And you do two of those. The second time you do it, you gotta end with double BMG. Use your tongue to push out the air here. Don't use all air, don't go loud. Go loud. And then after that you make the inward bass. Hey. So the second time is... Hey. 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 So learn that whole thing. Hey. So that whole thing you do. Try to learn this as well. If you learn that, you continue with So this is the most difficult pattern of this whole routine, I think, because it's very fast with a But you gotta practice that, so So try to get that down first and then make it very fast like That will do good. So try to practice that start very slow and then you increase the speed and try as I said before practice a lot on the And the last thing you can practice if you want to as well so if you got all of those patterns and you practiced them a bit, I think you're ready to practice the whole routine now. So uh, let's do it together. I will make the whole routine myself and you can follow along looking at the beatbox script right on top of me or you can look at the beatbox script right in the description or you can look at the beatbox script at the end of this video. Whatever you like. You can also slow down me, and you sh probably should do that in the beginning. With that being said, let's go. I don't love you anymore. But the beauty of walk up by that door. But the every time I call me your name, it feels like nothing was the same. But I don't love you anymore. Beauty of walk up by that door. But every time I call me your name.
That's it guys, I hope you will learn the routine, thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all the support, and uh, yeah, I'm pretty much done with this video, so leave a like, leave a comment, share the video, and subscribe. My name is Kirby, and I am out. Okay.